How fast do you think this guy is going? Let me know in the comments below. He scared the crap out of me as he blew by. Anyway, follow me on TikTok to see the full video. It's hilarious. Hey, this is Chance of Chance of Freshman. And today I'm going to talk about some pros and cons of buying a used motorcycle. And at the end, you can make your decision for yourself. Now I want to start out as saying that I went the used route. I bought a used Duke 390 2016 and I didn't look back. Well, actually I did look back because I rushed it and have been lusting after MT-07 ever since. The first pro of buying a used bike is the price. If I bought my same bike new, I'd pay like six or seven thousand dollars. Some dealerships will try to tack on as much fees as they can. And there's tons of videos on YouTube telling you about what these dealerships try to get away with. Not to mention you're a new rider and riding gear is very expensive. Buying a used bike gives you that extra cash you need to get all that gear so you're on the road faster. Now there can be a flip side to that, the dark side. You can buy a used bike and after you get it, it breaks down on you. And with no warranty, you're stuck paying for all that. That's why you gotta do your research and you gotta test drive the heck out of that thing. And you gotta make sure you bring somebody that knows something about bikes to make sure that you're not getting ripped off. If you decide to buy a used motorcycle, you're not going to have that new feeling. It's yours. You get to break it in. But being a new rider, you might really break it in. As in break it. With a used bike, it's already been broken in. It might have some dents to it. But it doesn't matter because you're learning and you're getting better as a rider. And you're saving up for that next bike. So if you drop it, you just chop it up to an experience. The last thing that I'm going to talk about is fixing things on your motorcycle. Now if you have a new motorcycle, of course you just take it back to the dealership and for a year or two or however long your warranty is, they'll fix it for you. But you don't have that if you bought a used motorcycle. So you get there, you look up YouTube and you learn how to fix your own bike. And this can come in real handy when you get the bike that you really want. Now that also has its downsides. For me, the first time I changed my oil, I ended up breaking two screws on the oil filter cap. Now that was very embarrassing because I had to get a tow, tow it to the dealership, and they ended up baby proofing it for me. But I learned from my mistakes, and I have been fixing little things on my bike ever since. In the end, after you've passed your MSF course, hopefully, getting on the road is what's most important. Whether it's new or used, you are still in for a lot of fun. If you can think of any other pros and cons of buying a used motorcycle, write them in the comments below. And if you liked the video, Press that like button and subscribe. And as always, ride safe.